5 Medicines That Are Fatally Damaging Your Liver Right Now Can't you sleep at night because of your pillow? Here is adjustable sandwich pillow to support your neck, back, and spine. Enjoy a perfect sleep. You can have it too. Number 5. Acetaminophen. Acetaminophen, a readily available pain relief medication found in popular products like Tylenol and Excedrin, is also a key component in creams and ointments designed for muscle pain relief. The primary cause of acute liver failure is often attributed to an excessive intake of acetaminophen. Factors such as alcohol consumption, genetic predisposition, and concurrent use of other medications can compound the risk of liver damage. The impact of acetaminophen on the liver may manifest between 24 to 72 hours post-consumption, with symptoms typically appearing 2 to 4 days afterward. It is strongly advised against taking multiple over-the-counter or prescription drugs containing acetaminophen without consulting a healthcare professional due to the associated risk. Number 4. Anticonvulsants Certain drugs employed in the treatment of epilepsy, a seizure disorder, have the potential to harm the liver. Although this risk is more prevalent in older anticonvulsant medications, newer alternatives are generally less associated with liver damage. Examples of anti-seizure drugs that may pose a risk to the liver include Dilantin, Phenytoin, Felbitol, Felbamate, and Valproic Acid. Liver injury from these medications can manifest between one to six weeks after initiating the treatment. Number three, antibiotics. Antibiotics, medications used to combat bacterial infections, may be linked to liver damage, particularly certain oral and topical varieties. Examples of such antibiotics include isoniazid, metronidazole, amoxicillin clavulinate, azithromycin, tetracycline, and clindamycin. Liver damage due to these antibiotics typically becomes apparent within weeks of administration. Number 2. Methyl dopa. Methyl dopa, a medication utilized in the management of high blood pressure, hypertension, is generally not recommended for individuals with pre-existing liver disease, particularly cirrhosis resulting from prolonged injury. This caution is due to its association with drug-induced liver damage. Liver injury symptoms may become apparent within the range of 2 to 12 weeks after initiating methyl dopa treatment. Number 1. Statins. Statins, commonly prescribed for high cholesterol, may lead to elevated liver enzyme levels in individuals undergoing blood tests, indicating potential drug-induced liver damage. Among statins, Lipitor, Atavastatin, is notably associated with drug-induced liver injury. It's important to note that the onset of liver injury from statins is not immediate. It may take anywhere from a month to up to 10 years for the damage to manifest. Other Drugs Various commonly used medications can impact the liver, including oral contraceptives, birth control pills, amiodarone, a medication addressing heart arrhythmias, and specific types of anesthesia. The time frame for liver damage induced by these drugs varies. For instance, damage related to birth control may take weeks or months to become evident, while anesthesia-induced damage can occur in as little as a few days. Supplements there are also supplements that have the potential to harm the liver, and many of these are accessible without a prescription, available over-the-counter, OTC, at pharmacies, health stores, and online. Supplements capable of causing liver injury encompass Anabolic steroids These synthetic versions of the testosterone hormone, promoting muscle growth, typically result in liver injury within 1 to 24 months of commencement. Green tea extract. This herbal supplement may lead to liver injury within one to six months after initiation. Multi-ingredient supplements. Products with more than one component can induce liver damage within one to four months, contingent upon their composition and dosages. Vitamin A. The prolonged use of this vitamin supplement can lead to liver damage after several months. Niacin. This supplemental form of vitamin B, 
used for high cholesterol treatment, can cause liver damage within two days to several months after starting. Can't you sleep at night because of your pillow? Here is adjustable sandwich pillow to support your neck, back, and spine. Enjoy a perfect sleep. You can have it too. How do you know if your liver is damaged from medicine? Prior to diagnosing drug-induced liver damage, healthcare providers must engage in discussions regarding your symptoms, conduct a physical examination, and inquire about any medications and supplements you are taking. Blood tests can be ordered to assess liver functionality, with elevated levels potentially indicating liver damage. What liver function tests can tell you? Diagnosing drug-induced liver damage involves excluding other potential causes of liver disease. Key considerations in this diagnostic process include The initiation date of the medication Liver response upon discontinuation of the medication Any impact on the liver upon restarting the medication Specific details of the liver injury Exploration of other potential causes of liver damage Investigation into whether the medication has been associated with liver damage in other individuals Treatment in the event of drug-induced liver damage, the initial course of action involves discontinuing the offending drug, if feasible. Depending on the severity of liver damage and your symptoms, your healthcare provider may recommend rest, avoidance of exercise, and intravenous, for fluid administration. Most instances of drug-induced liver injury exhibit improvement within days to weeks after stopping the medication. A full recovery typically takes two to three months, during which supportive care is administered to alleviate symptoms. Long-term management necessitates steering clear of substances that could harm the liver, such as alcohol or acetaminophen. Drug-induced liver injury. Drug-induced liver injury refers to harm caused by the use of prescription or over-the-counter OTC medications or supplements. The symptoms of liver damage vary among individuals, manifesting either shortly after initiating medication or over an extended period, months, or even years. Healthcare providers can conduct blood tests to assess liver function for potential damage. After excluding other causes of liver damage, a diagnosis of drug-induced liver injury is established. Can't you sleep at night because of your pillow? Here is adjustable sandwich pillow to support your neck, back, and spine. Enjoy a perfect sleep. You can have it too. Looking for more amazing videos? Check out the videos popping up on the right and the left of your screen. Hope you have a wonderful day.